Hello Aries, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star, Star, Star and welcome to your reading. So Aries, this is your reading for the month of May and this is a general reading to what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. In this reading, Aries, uh, we will see what is the energy dynamic between you and your ex and energy dynamic between you and your next, that is the next romantic partner. Okay. So, like I said, this is a general reading. Take what was needs and leave what doesn't. Aries, I would also appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below. Uh, there is an extended reading for this one. Link is in description box and comment section. So, I have shuffled the cards. I will lay them down now and let's discuss. First, we are going to talk about your ex. Three cards for your, for your ex and three cards for your next. So as far as your ex is concerned, we have, just a sec, let me adjust the angle. So as far as the ex is concerned, we have Knight of Cups. So Knight of Cups does represent an energy of uh, feeling bad, fe regretful regarding something that has happened in the past. Someone is willing to come towards you with an apology. It also represents uh, wanting to apologize, wanting to make amends. Okay, something that is broken that they want to fix that. So, uh, I also want to, I, I mean, Knight of Cups is also giving me an energy of uh, the fact that they want to be nice this time around. Okay, they want to give this chance to themselves. I'm, I mean, if you decide to give them a chance, it will be a chance for them to be nice, to prove themselves that yes, they can be nice. They can treat you the way you deserve. Okay. This person is seriously regretful about their own behavior, uh, whatever they have done to you in the past. And there is an urge to rectify the situation. Okay. There is a strong desire to rectify the situation. Okay. That's what is coming through with the Knight of Cups. Then we have the Magician. Yes. This person is manifesting you, Aries. Without any doubt, this person is manifesting you. And not only manifesting you, this person is... <clears throat> they... I think so. They are trying to establish energetic connection with you or if it is already existing they are trying to strengthen that energetic connection with you because they want to convey something to you so at the moment they probably are feeling like uh, you're far off somewhere you know uh, you are in your own world you are you have your own priorities you probably have some of you have moved on or some of you are working towards moving on and this person by strengthening the energetic connection with you or by establishing a strong energetic connection with you this person actually wants to communicate something to you because they feel like you probably have uh, still have a lot of anger in your mind as far as they are concerned as far as whatever ha whatever happened in the past is concerned they want to apologize you they want to uh, I mean if they come towards you directly the possibility of you dismissing this person is way too high so that is why they are trying to establish an energetic connection with you they are trying to uh, they are trying to remind you of them they are trying to remind you of their energy they are trying to remind you of the good moments that both of you had spent they want your memory to be fresh in your mind. Uh, they want their memory to be fresh in your mind when they will come back. Okay. So they are trying to clear the runway before the plane lands. Uh, they're trying to remove the hurdles. They're trying to make, uh, they're trying to smoothen the process a little bit. Okay. Before they come. This person is trying to manifest you. I think so. They are putting some sincere efforts towards you. Oh my God. We have lovers over here. Hmm. 
lovers are telling me aries that they sincerely believe that there is still an unfinished business between both of you there is still something that needs to be attained or achieved and uh, this lifetime has been specifically given to both of you to achieve that goal or finish the unfinished business they committed a mistake in the past they they were not good to you and they they are regretful about their behavior but they genuinely feel like there is still something that is meant to happen between both of you and it i mean they feel like it is our duty to obey the universe's command universe's intention and universe's intention is for both of us to come together and of course indeed even they want that they want to explore this connection with you aries they really want to explore this connection in the truest sense maybe they were they were scared in the past because of the intense emotions that they felt towards you maybe uh, they did not recognize how important uh, this opportunity is this was a once in a lifetime opportunity and they were absolutely wrong about it they were absolutely wrong about it i think so this person triggered emotions inside you and when you started reciprocating this person started running away ghosting you they were probably uh, they wanted a casual situation but when you started reciprocating emotionally they probably got scared a bit and they were not ready for what you wanted at that point of time and uh, they committed a huge mistake they committed a huge mistake in the past okay but now they want to rectify that's what i'm getting so there is a possibility that this person might text you might call you might apologize you but i do feel like efforts are being put towards reconnecting with you let's talk about your new person we have the five of swords the new person is going to be very protective about you uh, they will be uh in a way i feel like i heard the word competitive i mean uh, if there is a need to fight off any damn competition to win your heart to win your attention they won't hesitate in doing that okay this person is is like they know like how how deeply they like you they love you they know how strongly they are attached to you and they the best thing over here with the new person is that they have recognized that this is this is something that will not happen again and again in their life okay this is a rare opportunity that has come towards them and it is their job to work on it okay and they indeed it's not just because of the job that they are feeling it's not just because they are feeling that this is a rare opportunity but they indeed they do have some strong deep rooted feelings but the good part over here is this person is a self aware person this new person okay they are aware of their emotions for you so how deeply they feel for you how strongly they are attached to you they are absolutely aware of all these things so they want to honor those feelings they want to honor what they are feeling for you and that is why i feel like this person will be like ever ready to do whatever it is needed to do to to win your heart to be with you okay that's what i'm getting from this card five of swords like they are coming across as an ever ready person okay i have to fight off the competition i'm going to do that i need to impress aries i'll do that i have to gift uh, i have to bring certain gifts to aries i'm going to do that i need to stand up for aries i'll do that okay i need to ward off any kind of negative energies i'll do that i i am madly in love with aries and i'll do anything to win aries is heart like it's like come what may kind of an energy i am getting from this person <laughs> four of cups i think so this person has lost some really good people in in their life okay and that is also one of the reason like they 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 fear like so i somehow i feel like they have lost people with whom they developed really good relationships or with whom they had wonderful bond like uh parents maybe siblings or probably good friends maybe for some of them exes maybe when i say lost that does not necessarily mean a demise loss of relationship loss of uh, uh friendship for whatever reasons or probably 
this person had to relocate to a different country, different place for their work reasons. And then the communication kind of uh, reduced and then it kind of stopped afterwards. So they have lost many relations. They have lost many people in their life and they don't want that to happen when it comes to you. They want to treasure uh, every single moment with you. They want to experience love, affection with you and they want to cherish those moments and that is why i feel that this person really won't hesitate in expressing themselves and in letting you know how much madly they are in love with you that's what i'm getting and to what extent they will go to to protect you to be with you to take care of you they will not at all hesitate in letting you know okay the six of swords i do feel like this person is from a distance they are healing from some sort of uh, loss or some sort of uh, uh, something has happened in their life recently okay it's a loss of a relationship loss of a person loss of a job something has happened and they there was a time in this person's life where they experienced a lot of stagnancy in their life a lot of stagnancy and uh, because of that loss whether it's a loss of a situation or a person but now with six of swords from next to five or next to four of cups i feel like this person is moving away from that four of cups energy okay so they are they have started healing themselves maybe this person will uh, take up uh, traveling uh, purposefully uh, to heal themselves and maybe during travel you guys are going to cross paths I feel you haven't met this person yet indeed, okay? So that's what I see for you, Aries. I hope this resonates. Hit like, share, and subscribe. Comment down below. Link for the extended is in the description box and comment section. In the extended, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you. Action they will take towards you and likely conclusion between you and this person. Alrighty, take care. Have a great time and bye-bye.